here we are at our camp spot for our winter camp, our hot tent camping. And it's January 4th, 2022. There's our dead tree H that's pretty much covered up with snow, which is so good to see year, this year after last year's lack of snowfall. So we'll stop here and have our lunch and then we'll start to prepare the ground for our tent. Okay, here we've packed down our snow with our snowshoes going around and back and forth. And there's the husband and the folks. And so we'll let this sit for a minute and settle and then we'll start setting up the tent. All right, tent is up. We don't have the stove in it yet. It has started to snow, snowing quite heavily. Of course, that's what we love. So maybe we'll wake up tomorrow morning with a foot of snow on us. Um, that's what Scott's doing right now is uh, digging kind of little trenches as, so the snow can slide off on, and not bury us. And so we'll get our gear inside and then off to cut some wood. Those trees. In the summertime, that right there, that really pretty mound of snow is our usual spot to camp that's fairly close to the river and there's the river <laughs> and there's the hubby taking off we're gonna head off for a little little stroll okay i won't film it No, I didn't film it. Okay, you ready? Uh, nice and toasty and warm. There she is, all lit. Already, it's gone up by what, four, 13 degrees? Yeah, since we started, yeah. Since we started, so it was 41 in here and now it's up to 54, feel, feeling not too bad. And just hanging out right now. It's six o'clock and so nice and dark outside, nice and Toasty inside. There's the hubby with his headlamp and our thermometer. 69. Let's see if it'll. Oh, it just went to 70. And so, yeah, nice and toasty in here. And we actually brought up our iPad, watch a movie here in a minute, and then go to bed. Okay, see you in the morning. All right, it's. The morning of January 5th. Um, don't know what time it is. Actually slept really good. Stayed really warm. Didn't get too cold last night in the 30s. Low 30s. Pretty much snowed all night. Is as you can see. Still snowing. And we're off to stretch out. and Gotta rest my back. My back gets tired of sitting in the tent too much so we'll go on a stroll also get some more wood for the stove and had breakfast so yeah great day and yes as you can see we got lots of snow and but talk again
Okay, we're gonna leave some bread crumbs behind in case we get lost. We're gonna leave little crumbs behind. So we can find our way back. A rarely seen snow mushroom. Only comes out once every five years. And we're about to walk upon it. Okay, we'll leave it undisturbed and we'll put our next breadcrumb right here. All right, next breadcrumb. Cyclops. As you say, Cyclops, you can't tell that my husband, the kite maker, <laughs> no artistic abilities at all. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. So here's the rare snow mushroom. Blooms once every five years. All right, it's still Wednesday, the 5th, and it's about 2.15ish, still snowing. Uh, we're out for our second walk of the day. A little hard to find the trail, but I don't know how much snow you think's fallen since yesterday. <laughs> yes, dear. Eight inches. Probably eight inches. Eight to ten. Eight to ten. And, but so pretty, so quiet. I think we're the only ones up here in the critters, but they're all hunkered down. Seen a few tracks, but not many. And so, yes, and I'm out of breath. I'm, my age is catching up to me. Plus, breaking ground with snowshoes is hard work, especially for me. Anyway, we're going to continue our walk. As you can see, though, just absolutely beautiful up here. Another snow mushroom. Okay, thumbs up. This is the H stump. So two trees that grew together, connected at the base, it forms an H. Every year we come up, we take pictures here by it. And uh, it's not gonna last too much longer. Yeah, sometimes she gets up on top of it and sits there, but can't do it now. All right, so heading back to camp, and here's the tent. So that was cleared off an hour ago or so. We had it cleared off, and it's buried again. Probably eight to ten inches of snow total last night and today. So we'll dig it out, tighten everything back up. Ah, so much snow has fallen, we kind of have to unbury the tent. Dig it out. It'll be fun tomorrow trying to pack it up.
part as it's coming down, it'll probably be buried within a, an hour or so again. All right, it's Thursday the 6th. Packing it up. We're too old to stay more than a couple nights. It has snowed pretty much the whole time. Um, and still snowing. So they've gotten quite a bit up here, which is awesome. All right, came down by myself. So pretty snow, much snow has fallen. This is the river again with a blanket, probably a foot, maybe a foot and a half of new snow. And so just untouched and so pretty. We'll head back up. We'll hook the polks up to us and start heading out. Well, after about at least a foot of snow, we're heading out. It's going to take a long time getting out. Got to break trail again. There she goes.